there are incidences now involving ministers. What is the Prime Minister's decision, the decisive action that needs to be taken? That is quite worrying because we, if we turn a blind eye on it, then who is going to address it? And will you have the opportunity to uh, address it later on? Because these are critical issues, because leadership uh, determines the culture uh, and the uh, standards within the organization. And therefore, uh, it's so important. And, uh, you know, I have been very honest in this. We have some serious questions about how Prime Minister has handled some of the issues. It involves his senior ministers, you know, whether they are, uh, it's proper to conduct proper investigations. Uh, if he is not accepting some of the uh, allegations or whatever, why don't you conduct a proper investigation so that you have all the information that you need so that you can make an informed decision on the issue. And that will also clear uh, those involved, you know, that's justice. Mm. Secondly, uh, let's step them aside so that they do not interfere with the processes. Uh, that should be the obvious and the right thing to do mm. so that we can continue with the investigations. But again, as I've said, it must start from the top. Mm. And uh, that's the challenge that uh, is before the Honourable Prime Minister now and his ministers.